and welcome to this new exciting Lego Technique Challenge. Today we are going to take a look at our new pullback models, the quad bike and the record breaker, which are pretty awesome, aren't they? We are going to race them across the room and see which one is going fastest. So which one do you think is going to win? We created a racetrack right here in the middle of our office. The first model that reaches the end will be the winner. Let's do it! So what I'm going to do is to pull back both motors to their max to give both the vehicle the maximum speed. Alright, ready, steady, go! breaker was a clear winner. Did you guess that? But you know why this happened? Let's take a look. So what's going on here? With the surface we are racing on, the most obvious thing is the gearing from the different wheel sizes. You can see here that the tires are very different on the two models. The record breaker tires are much smaller than the quad bike. Because both models receive the same amount of force, the smaller tires will have a greater acceleration than the larger tires. It means it accelerates at a faster race as soon as I let the model go. The quad bike, on the other hand, is designed to go off-road and with its large tyres, it will travel a longer distance per revolution on this smooth surface. This means that over a longer distance, the quad bike would eventually overtake the record breaker and win the race. So the record breaker won and lived up to its name. But one can argue it wasn't really fair for the quad bike because the quad bike is not really designed for a smooth surface like this. But did you know you can combine these two models and get a combi models with two pullback motors? That maybe could be a good challenge between the combi model and our record breaker. Thank you for watching. See you next time. Bye. <laughs>